What's going on boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Megamoothman and today I'm bringing you guys a quick TDM on Black Ops on Nuketown, my trusty old Spaz 12. I'm going to talk really fast because this game is going to be over really quickly. What is my trusty old Spaz 12, stained red with the blood of my enemies and I've been really enjoying Black Ops a lot more lately. It's really nice to take a break from that shitty spawn fest dead man's hand of a game known as Warfare 3 and I've really just been enjoying playing Black Ops a lot lately and I, feel, I, I was feeling like I was just playing Warfare 3 like just for the sake of playing it, just grinding my tits off and you know, just not really enjoying it. But now me and a couple of friends who kind of feel the same way have uh, been playing a bit of Black Ops, playing like 50-50 Black Ops Warfare 3 and uh, it's, it's been a been a lot of fun. I don't know what it is about Modern for 3. Something to do with the map design and the spawn system that just makes Black Ops feel a lot more, you know, consistent than Modern for 3. I don't know if you guys really know what I'm getting at here, but not as much random shit happens in Black Ops to ruin your streaks. Like, you know what I'm talking about? Like that dead man's hand, snipers, or crappy spawns. Just that random, uncontrollable crap that happens to you in Modern for 3. It just pisses you off so much. You just want to... Punch a cat right in the face! Ugh. But I'm just playing Black Ops is a lot more fun to play than Warfare 3 right now. And uh, let's talk about this little baby I've got in my hands, the Spaz 12. And although it feels a little different, it still kind of packs that same kick ass punch that it did in Warfare 2. And definitely not compared to that piece of crap in Warfare 3. But the Spaz 12 is pretty much the best shotgun in Black Ops. It's got good spam ability and damage, so you essentially get the best of both worlds. Any seasoned Black Ops veteran is going to tell me that you should really use the silencer on the Spaz, because, you know, it doesn't reduce the damage at all, and I am completely aware of that. The reason I don't use the silencer is because I'm a man. I like to go loud. I like to hear the sound of the shells cracking through my enemy's skulls. Well, that just got a little bit dark there, but all I really want to talk about to you guys in this commentary was about how I'm going to be going away for a couple of days, going out to my uncle's farm to visit some family because a lot of them live up north, and so I'm going to miss you guys. I'm not going to have many videos up lately, but it's been a really quick commentary, like two minutes or something, and uh, I hope you guys are having an awesome time, whatever you're doing, and I'll see you later. Peace. We are victorious. Hold to our yeah, bro. Your KD is below two digits. You're not in phase.